What's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with the beautiful baby girl. This is Crystal. It's actually a very exciting video because I'm gonna be blanketing her for the first time. Now, I don't know if anyone who owned her before me ever blanketed her, but I've owned her for about six years now. And throughout that time, I have never put a blanket on her. I used to live in South Florida. I grew up in Miami. That's where I got her and that's where I kept her for a long time until I moved a little bit more north. And the weather's a tiny bit different up here. It does get colder. I'm super excited. I don't know how she's gonna react. We've done a lot of desensitizing in general and for my Halloween costume She seemed to do pretty well. She wasn't bothered by it at all So I don't think we'll have a problem putting a blanket on her today I thought I'd film it like this is like a first-time thing. I thought I'd document it <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoy coming along and let's see how this goes Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is just groom her just so she's nice and clean under the blanket It's a new blanket. I want to try and keep it clean <laughs> Let me show you guys my blanket first. Here it is. Let me give you all the deets. This is the Tough One medium heavyweight turnout blanket. It's 600 denier, waterproof. It has 3D rings to connect hoods and neck covers, fleece weather protection, waterproof rip stuff, breathable poly, 210D lining, 250 grams of polyfill, a tail flap, shoulder gussets for better fit and freedom of movement, and bar tack strong cross or single belly straps and removable leg straps. So yeah, this is from Tough One and mine is actually red, which I think is gonna look so beautiful on her. Um, I will leave the blanket linked down below if you guys are interested in it. Let's get started. Are you ready? Let's do it. Now here's the thing. I'm not gonna like tiptoe around her or anything like that. Obviously I'm gonna be gentle and careful because it's her first time. I feel like it scares the horses even more when you act like that. So I'm just gonna chill, relax, act like it's just a saddle pad and we'll see how it goes, okay? <laughs> okay, taking it out of the bag and I think this noise is freaking her out, but you're okay. I know, it's okay. I'm gonna let her smell it for a second. Mmm, smell good. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it on her. I know I should probably put it on her left side, just like you would a saddle and all that stuff, but the sun is shining in a way that if I put the camera facing this way, then you're not gonna be able to see it. So I think I'm gonna have to do it on the other side of her. I think it'll be fine. Okay, I know there's like an easy way you have to fold it so that you can place it on her back and then you unfold it so it's not like this huge tarp that you're putting on them. I'm gonna try to do that and if it doesn't work, I'm just gonna go with it, you know? First, I think I need to unclip these things. Unclipped. Oh, I gotta do it on this side too. There's this little, I think these might be the surcingle things. I got that. This blanket feels so nice. I just wanna like cuddle up in it. Okay, I think this is the front. Yes, the buckles are in the front. So I'm gonna unbuckle this. Okay, it's unbuckled. I'm mostly nervous for my camera because in case she freaks out, I don't want her to run into my camera or knock it over or something. I guess that's the life of a YouTuber, right? Especially an equestrian YouTuber. <laughs> I don't wanna block you guys. Maybe I'll do this. Okay, I think that's better. Good girl. Good girl. Good job. You see? Not scary. Good job. It's okay. Good girl. You're okay. So that's gonna go there. And that's gonna go there. Good girl. Good this here. Good job. Look at that. You're doing so good. Levi, go away. Levi, go away. Go away. I'm gonna go around her from the front instead of going through the back because just in case she tries to kick that blanket off, I do not want to be behind there. Good girl. Good job. Okay, guys. So far, so good. I am so happy about this. Now we're gonna do the front buckles. Maybe I should bring you guys up here so you can see. Okay, we're gonna do this here. Have you had one of these on before? Huh? Why do I feel like you might have had one of these on? You are way too calm, honey buns. You've done this before, haven't you? Hmm? Am I the only beginner here? All right, so I got the front on. Oh, 
case. Now we gotta do the belly. I know I'm supposed to cross something underneath. I know that. Hold on. I got this. I think this one crosses here. This one crosses here. Guys, I'm doing it. 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 She's doing so good. She's doing so good. I'm like 75% done. I still have to buckle the back legs, but so far so good. Good girl, baby. Good girl. All right, so this goes here, I think. Oh, okay. Now the other one. Good girl. You guys, she's all buckled in. She's all clipped on. I think the red looks so good on her. This blanket is gorgeous, man. And they have so many colors and designs to choose from. Let's do a little overview. Ooh, look at that. Why do I feel like I did something wrong in this area right here? Right? That looks kind of off. I crossed it underneath. I don't know, mama. You're so patient with me, huh? You're probably like, girl, get it together. I did the front here. Did the front. This side. Ooh, look at that. That was like anticlimactic, huh? She's like, why were you making such a big deal? I don't know why, but you are an angel. You're so good. I'm gonna go ahead and walk her off. If anything was gonna happen, it might happen at this moment because, you know, when they walk off, they feel things tighten in places. They feel stuff on them. Let's see how it goes. I think she deserves a treat. Hold on. I'm gonna give her one of these treats. I actually just got these, so I'm excited to see if she likes them or not. These are the appleberry flavored cookie cubes by Stanley Forage. This has low sugar and low starch. It's all natural and it's a forage based cookie. I'll show you guys what the packaging looks like. Let's see if she likes these. She deserves it, you know? She's been a good girl. I was expecting you to spook and freak out or buck or do something. Levi, it's not for you, sugar pie. Levi's actually is like right here. I don't know if you can see his little nose. This is what they look like. It looks like a little alfalfa cube. Mm, but they smell so good. Apple berries, I guess. It smells delicious. Ready? For being such a good girl. Levi's eating her crumbs. Oh my god, I wish I was getting this on camera. They just like touched noses. You want more? Oh my goodness. I guess you like them, huh? Give you one more. Okay, one more. Girl. All right, I guess that's a yes, huh? Is that a yes? You like these? I think so. All right, you guys. Now, the last thing I want to do before this video is over is actually turn her out and see what she does when she's, like, loose with the blanket on. And actually, I want to see how the other horses react, too. I wonder if they're going to rip it off. They better not, okay? You better keep your distance, okay? Okay, let's see how this goes. I'm going to go ahead and turn her out. They're looking at her like, what the heck is she wearing, huh? What the heck is she wearing? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. Whoa! <laughs> is she scaring you guys? Uh-oh, this is gonna be so interesting. I can't wait to see what they do when she's in there. <laughs> Let's see what she does. That is so funny. They're all huddling around her. That is so crazy. She is so calm though. What the heck? I thought she would like run off and buck or something. She seems to be used to it. Like maybe she's had it on before. I don't know. Maybe before I ever owned her. I mean, she is off the track. So do they blanket racehorses? I think they do. I don't know, but she's doing so good. Look at Brandy. Brandy is just sniffing it all over. So 
I guess everything's fine. She doesn't seem to mind it at all. She didn't spook, she didn't buck, she didn't rear, she didn't do any of that. And putting it on her was a breeze. So now we gotta take it off. I wanna wait until tonight. The temperature is dropping drastically tonight. Right now it's cold, but it's still like not cold enough for a blanket. So I'm gonna take it off now and put it on again tonight. But I think I'm gonna film the taking it off process as well. Now just give me a second while I go grab her again. <laughs> Now it's time to take it off. We've done good so far. Let's just hope we continue that way. All right, so I'm gonna start with these first. Okay, these back here. Okay. Now, the way I've seen people do it is like they fold it on top of the horse. So I'm gonna go ahead and try that. Let me unbuckle the front. Okay. And then I'll do that. I think this is how I should have started off. I think this is how it was supposed to be folded when I placed it on her, but I think we did fine either way. So now I just gotta grab this like that. Wow, I feel like a pro. You're a pro, mama girl. Okay, so now I'm gonna put the blanket back in its little pouch. <laughs> That is it for this video. I am so happy with her. She did such a great job. There was no spooking, no bucking, no rearing, nothing crazy today. It was a great experience, right? I'm guessing she most likely had a blanket on before I owned her. <laughs> but either way, I'm so happy and proud, okay? But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please, please, please give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Um, and if you're new, hi, my name is Cindy Valentina. This is Crystal, and we would love it if you subscribed, right? Right? We need more people to join the fam bam. <laughs> if you guys are interested in this blanket, I will leave a link down below in my description box. You know what? I think you deserve one more treat before we go. Hold on. Can you let me take it out of the bag first? My goodness. Here you go. Good job today, baby. You're not even done chewing. Here. This is the last one. <laughs> I'll also leave these linked down below if you guys are interested in them as well. I've been doing that lately, so let me know if you like it. Dude, I'm trying to talk here. I've been trying to do that lately, um, linking stuff in the description box, because I feel like it's helpful for you guys if any of you are interested in any of the things you see in my videos, so hopefully it's helpful. Let me know. All right, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Girl, girl, this is ridiculous right now. I'm trying to do an outro and you are interrupting. Um, and for my Halloween costume. And for my Halloween. And for my Halloween costume. What the heck? And for my Halloween. And for my Halloween. And for my Halloween. And for my Halloween.